hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today in this video we are going to create a contour from a dem so for that i have downloaded the SITM dem from asa's website and after using that dem we will be creating a contour map and i will also show how can you make the contour interval and create a different symbology for different uh, level of contours so for that case let me add a contour data so i have this contour data from uh, SITM so I will be using that contour so sorry I will be using that dem and for that dem I have this uh, in like folder connection I have this dem so I will be using this dem and then I will uh, okay so I will also insert one um, save file this is my area of interest and using this area of interest I will be using clipping mask property uh, and then I will only extract the area of interest for uh, creating a dim. So for that case, let me source uh, in source panel. I'll source as mask. So you can also <coughs> source that by uh, from this uh, arc toolbar uh, box. For that case, let me show you this. So inside special analysis tool maybe I think and then extraction and extract by mask so you can use this also so input raster will be for it that case I'll use this uh, dim data and after that I will save my uh, oh, so sorry input raster will be raster or feature mask data will be fedikola so this is fedikola is the area of, uh, in which I will be um, extracting my dim data and this is the dem data original dem data so i'll save this uh, my folder connection so i have this training and then i'll oh, sorry inside uh, maybe okay i'll save here so, i'll save as a b c okay and then okay so after doing this let's wait for a while okay so it has given the area of interest okay this is the area of interest so we didn't need this so we will be removing this area so for this i'll go to remove and i'll also remove this save file so now we have this uh, <coughs> dim data of my area of interest so for creating a contour i'll go to special analysis tool and this and then inside the surface you can see contour so i'll be using this properties property name contour so double click on this and we'll get this type of the box and i'll be using the input feature as input raster as abc and i'll save this uh, in the same folder as contour and then i'll save this okay after this uh, we'll be using the contour interval of 100 meter so this is a steep slope area and then we'll be using the uh, contour as and base control will be 0 and we'll use the z factor as uh, 1 it is given as 1 so we'll be using the same data so after that I'll click on ok ok so we have got this control and then maybe we don't need this background dim so I'll be removing this dim and after that we'll go to control and then properties <coughs> and then inside the label will be using contour and then we'll apply and after going to symbology we'll be going to quantities and we'll quantify this uh, contour on the basis of the number and then okay so it will give this different colors for different numbers and then we'll apply okay so you can see this beautiful contour map from the uh, dim data so okay we can also label this data for that i'll go to contour and then we'll click on this label feature so it will show the contour uh, of the individual line sorry okay so elevation of the individual contour contour line <coughs> we can see this is the elevation of uh, this con contour gives the area elevation of thousand meter it is 1200 meter so you can use this contour data uh, in creating a topo map as well as uh, various purposes so this is the contour map uh, we have been, uh, we have 
uh, made from our DM data. So in this in the next video, I'll be using uh, the same uh, control properties in creating a control from. Uh, uh, okay, so I'll be using elevation data which is obtained from the TS. So thank you very much for watching this video. Hope I hope this video was useful. Thank you very much.